I'm gonna change that battery. Okay. I'm gonna, we're gonna see. What I am so nervous and so excited. Okay, lean back a little bit. I have so many emotions right now. kind of person that can jump in anything you're like oh it's a flying trash can with wings let me go and I'm like hold up never done this before let me get my bearings around it first I'm not a risk taker no I'm, I'm, I'm very totally cautious jump in the trash can with wings you will I would totally you that. would definitely do that yeah they fit yeah they throw the all right oh nice the rose one nice I've, I've flown a stick before, so, oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be your pilot. No, get me out! Ah! I'm just kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Thank you again so much, this is amazing. I am very excited. Good. Why don't we go through the checklist? You got it. So, Illness, medication, stress, alcohol, fatigue, and eating, you're feeling okay? I'm safe. You're good. I'm just wondering if we start up here. Maybe we do. Give him a shout. Uh, here we go. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Clear prop! There you go, Dan Heard. Yeah, Thanks, good. Dan. Good. Okay, off we go. You ready? Off we go. Let's go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> So you're in the captain's chair, so we always fly Jerry's right-handed. Okay. And the throttle's in the middle. I do have an extension bar, a special instructor's extension bar. Okay, I but, like it, very uh, good. Yeah, there's only one wheel brake. So this is the wheel brake, so nothing on the toes. Nothing. Uh, yeah. Having the uh, aeroplane. Okay. So there we go, have a little go. Okay, just nice and easy, wheel brake. It. Okay, so good. Gotcha, now gotcha. have a little wiggle on the pedals. Feel a little wiggle, okay. So they, <laughs> they kind of feel a bit different to an aeroplane as well. So a little bit. Follow these guys. You got it. Right, you're in control. Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. so just uh, so all we got to do is control the speed. We're going downhill, so we might have yeah. to get a brake on occasion. All right, I pulled back on the throttle just a little bit so I don't have yeah, to yeah, ride the brake. Fine. Okay, yeah. how do I talk to the outside world? So you've got the, the, Back the here. switches. Okay, the okay. So when you want to shoot someone. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I got it, okay. Got the trigger switch. Very good. So, um, I guess today I'll do the takeoff. You got it. But you're very welcome to follow me through. Okay, okay. perfect. And I'll kind of talk through. I keep trying to press on the brakes down there. I know, I know. <laughs> so funny. It's instinct, you know, instinctive to it is. Yeah, I think I think it's uh, half the problem with uh, converting uh, yeah. uh, airplane pilots is unlearning stuff. Yeah, you know? it's uh, in some ways it's an advantage, and it was I think you know probably advantage for me having you know learnt uh, the gyrocopter right right from the start and uh, not confusing it with any other type of aircraft. Yeah. Oh, hey, here's that 190. I can fly that airplane. Slow down a, sh a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got it. Yeah, we were going up the hill, and then all of a sudden we were going downhill. That's it. Yeah. And we're going to pull up alongside them. Um, okay. We don't have a great turning circle. So okay, you uh, got it. So give plenty of room. early. Yeah. Got it. Okay. Oh, I'm roasting. Are you warm? It is warm. Yeah. It's okay. Well, the we heating's can... off at the moment. Yeah, let's not turn the heater <laughs> on. It actually feels really good in here. Yeah, a good trip so far. Been fun. Oh, it's been great. It's so beautiful up here. Awesome. Yeah, it's a great place to live here. It seems very like quiet and calm, and you know, oh, you get away is. from kind of the hustle and bustle of everything. Yeah. No, it's a great place to live. Yeah. Here we go, sunshine. That's what we ordered, wasn't it? Yeah, exactly. Just in time. <laughs> Okay, they're, they're lined up behind us, I think. Okay. Holding Alpha 1, ready for departure. Roger, hold Alpha 1. Holding Alpha 1. Okay, sounds like whatever. Seven, three, four, whatever Charles their problem was, they're sorted. Right on right, 2-9. Right, Slacker, right, 1, 1, 2-9. Go 
Golf Fix to Zulu, hold position, request out of above 2,000 feet to coordinate with radar. Hold position, not above 2,000 feet, Golf Fix Zulu. <laughs> yeah. Right. We're going to do for a chase, Foxtrot, taxi to the south, Break. station via 29, Echo and Alpha. Take the wheel brake off. I'm going to swap hands because I fly right handed. Okay. <laughs> Zulu, wind zero seven zero degrees six knots, runway zero five, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff zero five, golf fix Zulu. Okay, so we'll get it going, get it turning. So mind the trigger button, but feel free to hold on to the stick. Okay. So what I'm watching there is the rotor up. Here. You see the rotor up again in the middle? It's on two hundred at the moment. Just increasing that rotor up again. There we go. And now one, release the brake. Take the two stick fully back. Three, release the brake. So it makes a lot of noise to start with. But this is the rotor up again. That's what we're looking at. Okay. And so just going to add some power. Now. There we go. Wheel balance. Hold it on weight. There we go. How's that? Now we're flying, we're just going to increase our airspeed until we've got kind of 65. Up we go. So it's a slightly different takeoff profile to fix me. It's all about managing these rotors, getting it off the ground, and then speeding up before we climb away. There we go. How's that? Right, you have control of the stick. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> so, so use this black T in front of you. Okay. That's kind of your reference. We're doing about 70 knots at the moment. Let's do a gentle turn left. Gentle turn to the left. Yeah. That's it. Golf to the golf, uh, no level restrictions on departure. There we go. 60 degrees, 6 knots, from the five, clip the takeoff. And we're going to go over to this lighthouse over here. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to take it off turbo now to okay. bring a bit of power back. There we go. Oh. Relaxed. <laughs> can't, you can't. Copy to traffic information to Jabiru. Where do you want to meet a turn to? Uh, just this heading over here. There's a, a lighthouse on the end of this. Uh, oh, the lighthouse, little okay. Of land. Okay. Okay, we're going to come back to cruise there. I'm going to bring the power back to about. 29. Okay. And taxi taxi open via Alpha and Echo. Okay. Just feeling relaxed. So you've got this button on top. This is the trigger. Okay. So you're pulling it left or right. You can move the gotcha. okay. right foot fore and aft. Oh my gosh. To, to, you should be able to just let go and it'll fly itself. All right, she's pitching down a little, so I'm so just gonna. Back, uh, yeah, that's it. Pull it okay. back for about half a second or so. Uh, yeah, okay. And then just let go. Uh, pitching left slightly, so I'm rolling to the tower. Go, please, please. Traffic to the traffic information, Jabiru helicopter, five miles to the north of the field, joining downwind to the left runway zero five. Looking for traffic there, go, uh, please, please. Uh, there's actually an airplane. Where is he? Right, so we're just going to follow the beach. So, I'll tell you what, why don't we uh, rover land? Okay, because you're nervous, I want to show you all the scary stuff first. Oh my gosh, okay. Right, you ready? I have control then. You have the flight control. So all I'm going to do is demonstrate what happens if the engine quits. Okay, so I'm just going to bring the power to idle. <gasps> there you go. Yep. That's it. <laughs> Still okay. Flying. All we do is pick which one of these holes on the golf course we want to land on. <laughs> and that's it. So we glide the same. Yeah, okay. The, the only difference is we can glide vertically okay. as well as horizontally. So let's get the nose down. We're going to go down to about 500 feet and we'll just fly around the coast for a bit. Okay. Then you can get a good look out. There we go. 500 <laughs> feet there. So, uh, unlike an aeroplane, of course, you can't stall, so we can fly really slowly, 
uh, below a certain speed, we'll, we will descend, but um, okay. down to about 35 miles an hour, we can slow. There we go. Do you want to? Do you want to take control of the stick? Okay, I have my okay. control. So we'll just follow the coast down. You got it. There we are. Good for you, isn't it? How's our manifold pressure? Yeah, it's good. We're about 30, 31. Okay. That's good. This is amazing. It's cool, huh? So will your um, gyro hours count toward like the airlines or? No, it's completely different license. Okay. Yeah. Um, no, uh, but it would count if, uh, I mean, there's there's been a lot of developments with uh, the courses in the UK and of course this type of certified aircraft. So uh, in the UK, we're now able to do a commercial pilot's license in gyros, and uh, we do night and you know such such courses. So uh, well, it's uh, it's catching up. I'd say. Okay. It's certainly catching up. Okay, we'll get some speed up, and we'll get some height, and we're going to go and take a look at Loch Ness. See if we can see the monster. Okay. You take control. All right, I have control. Go. You have control. Oh, this is amazing. These views are incredible. Yeah, it's a good place to live. It's uh, you got you've got a real playground here. You feeling more relaxed yet? Yeah, definitely a little bit better. I, I feel like I'm in good hands with you. So <laughs> you're very kind. Uh. I want to know where the story of the Loch Ness Monster even comes from. I've never looked that up. I just know that there's, a, you know, tales of a monster it in Loch Ness. It must be true. It must be true. So many people have seen the monster. So many people have seen it? Oh, of course. My son sees it every time we go. Oh, okay. Up. Gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, special prize if you see it. Yeah. Monsters are she, of course. Is she, is she? Yeah, Nessie, right? Yeah. Where's the castle? Right down here. On this oh, wow. There. Okay. So we're going to head towards it. Okay. But what we'll do before that, we'll go out into the uh, middle of Loch Ness and take a look around. And then we'll drop down low and take a closer look. Thought maybe that was the monster, but uh, no, that's a boat. <laughs> I just saw a figure and then the wake. Yeah. Is this thing rated to fly in the clouds? No. But for nights, we do uh, instrument appreciation. So we still fly under the hood. Okay. Um, but um, no, we're not uh, able to get so. Okay, let's go down. So I'm going to chop the power. Okay. And uh, we'll just float down. It's like Mary Poppins. Oh my. Down on a uh, on her umbrella. Oh gosh. There we go. And we're just going to slow the airspeed to come down vertically. I mean, we can do, go down the quick way if you prefer. No, no, no. We're good. I'm happy to show you the quick way. What is the quick way? Uh, it's a bit of a spiral dive. Type oh. Thing. Oh my. Want to try that? Oh, uh, if you, if it's safe. Okay. Airspeed. Okay. That must make you nervous as a, a little. Pilot. Right, we're gonna lower the nose, <laughs> and we're gonna do a little turn. Wee. <gasps> There we go. It's not so scary, is it? Oh, it's really not. Okay. It takes ages to come down. You'll be, you know, you'll be screaming a long time. You know? That's it. Three, four, five degrees. Thank you, Zalus. Zero, five. We're going to need a tow mic. Okay. Get the power back in. Bit of torque. Oh, there's the castle. There it is. Uh, ah. 
Just going to do a quick fly past. It'll be out your side window in a second. people there. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is definitely a castle. Popular spot. Alright, we'll do a tight turn and okay. head back. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I know what's going on. Yeah. to get your uh, certification in the... Well, in the in the UK, it's a minimum of 45 hours. It's a full... 45? Field. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so there, and there's no, like, add-on or shortcut if you're already a fixed wing pilot? There is. Uh, it can be reduced to 25. Oh, okay. Uh, if you're an existing pilot. I would want to get all 45, probably. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a precautious Golf person. Yeah. Yeah. If I let go of it... Look at the string. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're well out of balance there. So put it back in. Oh, so that's like your rudder. Yeah. Like your, your ball. It is. It, but of course, that's it works amazing. opposite to the ball. The okay. So you kick the ball. Right. Kind of pull the string. It's a uh, strange business. In order to really wrap my head around this, it's very different. Control? Okay, I have no a flight control. Have I'm going to sit and have a snooze. <laughs> I'll listen just to tell that. me where to go. Yeah, we just, I'm just going to kind of... There's a fire duct in the distance. Yeah. We're heading for that. Basically. Okay. Okay, you going to land? Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, so we want to keep it around 60 to 70, and that's all with the stick. Okay. So to reduce height, let's bring the power back some more. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Twenty years passing Delta. Thank you all. That's good. Hold it there, Wayne. And try and get it in trim at this point, so that you're not going too Delta much. Delta Zulu, wind zero eight zero degrees seven knots, spread between zero one zero and zero nine zero degrees, runway zero five, clear to land. Clear to land zero five, Delta Zulu. Okay, so, we can come down pretty steep, it's all, it's all good. We're actually going to land at the midpoint. Okay. So, we'll just keep coming down as we are, that's nice. All looking good, so, ready for landing? Oh gosh, okay. Good. I'll follow you through, it's all good. Oh my gosh. You're going to be fine. So, okay. what we might do in a minute is as we round out, we can add a little bit of power. Okay. And fly at about two feet. Oh gosh, down the okay. runway and we'll, we'll land a bit further ahead. Okay. So, airspeed is everything, 60 to 70. And keep your butt over the centre. Okay, keep my butt over. Okay. There we go. And you've got your black okay. line, so we're just using... Okay, so add okay. some power now. Add, add some, some power. power. And we're just going to fly along horizontal, so... Oh bit, gosh. A bit more. There more, okay. That's it, a bit more, okay. and just keep it all straight, that's okay. it. Okay. Wait there. So don't pull back, just okay, hold it just there. Hold it. Just hold it there. Uh. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Whee! Power off. Keep the nose off the ground. Okay. You've done it. Perfect, because it is okay, left by runway 29, touch to north open by 29 and echo. It's <laughs> okay, left 29 to the north open, Gulf of Cthulhu, thanks. There you go. Well done. Okay. Easy. Yeah, oh, yeah. Easy. <laughs> super easy. You did it. No problem. There okay. Is. You have the fly control. I have control. Definitely different. Um, Tell me about your flights. From takeoff, how did it go? <laughs> it was nothing like I expected. On that takeoff, I thought we were going to rattle ourselves apart as soon as the rotor started spinning. Which like every I've, I've experienced that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Too soon, Dan. Um, honestly, so, you know, getting out there, doing kind of like the run up, you know, stuff like that, that was all very normal. And then we took the runway and that thing started whirling over us and I, would, I thought the world was ending. So just because I've never done it before, it was very unexpected. But then we, we started our roll, we got airborne, and then it was just amazing from there. We never got above 2,000 feet. Right. 
um, we kind of hovered. We were waiting for these guys, so we were hovering, but he showed me some different things like, all right, we're going to take the airspeed to zero. We're going to, he was like, we're going to do all the scary stuff, you right. know? Um, it was scary at first, but he showed me just how docile they are. And so it was very fun. Um, and then you went to Loch Ness? We went down to Loch Ness because I, I had to see the monster. And I saw what I thought would be a monster, but it just turned out to be a boat. So, <laughs> um, and then uh, we went, we, uh, we actually like spiraled down and saw the castle out there. Yes. And we waved hi to all the tourists. And then he made me do the landing, which was terrifying, by the way. But uh, as you can see, we made it in one piece, so can't be all that bad. Honestly, I would consider getting my um, PPLG, as they call well, it here. It, it, over in the United States, it's an endorsement, a gyro, rotor gyro endorsement. Yeah, I would definitely want like a, a number of hours yeah. in it before I, before I got that endorsement. Uh, I think before I got my endorsement, I was pushing 40. I would definitely want yeah. that. He, I asked him, you know, how many hours would it take? And he said, you know, here it's about a 45 hour course, but if yeah. you already have your fixed wing, they would shorten it to 25. I said, no, 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 I want all yeah, 45. I had, lot, <laughs> I had a lot more than that. So, okay, well guys, thank you for watching our gyro episode here from the United Kingdom. Special thanks, call out to Flying Eyes. You're wearing the female Flying Eye version. And uh, Flying Eyes is, is bringing us all here and it's been awesome. Also Colton Mortgage. Uh, they've kept us warm on this trip. I I'm, packed shorts. I am. <laughs> it's, it's so chilly here for me, being from Texas, that I am wearing two Colton hoodies. So we're cold here in sunny Scotland. At least sun is finally coming out. It is out. starting to finally come and out. And also Marshall Protective Services. Guys, thank you so much. And if if we reach 100,000 subscribers, Christy will jump out of a plane. Out of a gyro. Out of a plane, not a gyro. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. We'll see you guys next time. On taking off.